29 forecast. Typical of this time in September, we are seeing blue skies and a few friendly cumulus and a butterfly flying by as we look outside live through our Carter Mountain weather camera looking toward Charlottesville downtown and also the Blue Ridge Mountains. They're about 15 miles in the distance. Good Monday midday to you. I am meteorologist Josh Fitzpatrick. So the next big thing I'm tracking from the Weather Center is going to be another long dry spell. Lots of dry air in place and that will take us through the rest of the work and school week before changes arrive for the weekend ahead. All right, so in that first forecast for the rest of today, sunshine, a few fair weather clouds like what we saw on the weather cam moments ago. Daytime highs will be in the upper 70s, barely 80. I think most areas will top out in the low 70s for the valley, mid to upper 70s today by around 3, 4 o'clock across central Virginia with a northwesterly breeze and I'd say cooler and now drier direction. There go the rain showers as expected on Sunday afternoon and evening. Now that activity has completely moved on off the coast and we received less than a half inch. Many of you only picked up a tenth to maybe a quarter inch of rainfall as we put on the drought monitor. Yeah, you know, we're still in moderate to severe drought, so no dent in that drought. We'll get an update on the drought monitor, by the way, on Thursday morning. Dry scans on the Doppler radar scope area wide. The rain we had yesterday continues to pull into the northeast and into New England with more in the way of flooding rains up that way. Our weather flow is from the west and northwest. Look at all this dry air, a huge area of high pressure from the Great Plains states all the way basically to the Rockies and into the Pacific Northwest. So several dry days ahead. So there's our future cast map on Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, and then by the weekend, here comes a coastal storm. There's this is Saturday into Sunday. Right now, some of our forecast trends want to back it farther to the west, and that would introduce a pretty good chance of rain for the weekend. Now, this week, overnight lows will be in the 40s and the 50s, mostly in the 50s, and highs will reach the upper 70s and low 80s, which is about right on target for this time of the year. In your storm team, 29 report today, highs of 75 to 80 degrees, most areas in the 70s, sun and clouds overall mild and pleasant. For tonight, a clear sky, areas of fog will form like what we had this morning, especially along the river valleys with lows in the upper 40s to the mid 50s. And your forecast on Tuesday, mid 70s to lower 80s with sunshine, blue skies and barely a cloud to be found in the sky. Seven day forecast, upper 70s, low 80s, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, and with the cooler overnights, ragweed pollen will be on the rise through the middle part of the week. So far, so good for high school and college football on Friday, increasing clouds, and we'll watch this weekend with off and on rain. Jared.